how to add discount prices on Shopify. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'll show you guys how you can get started with adding discount prices on Shopify. So let's get into it. Now, there are multiple different ways that you can display a discount on your Shopify store. This includes adding a price compare ad in your product, building discounts, offering bundles, and offering bundle discounts. So let's take a look at all of the different ways that you can create discounts. First off, to display a discounted price on Shopify, you can head on over into your Shopify dashboard and click on products. Once you click on products, pick out any product. So let's say we have this child's bunny romper. And if I scroll down, I even have a variant of this particular product. So you have two different variants. I have two different variants for this. But if this was a single item product, so if I take another example to show you guys a comparison, let's say we have this dress over here so in this particular dress that we have i don't think we have any variant so yeah this item does not have any variants and it has a simple price listed now if i want to display this as a marked down price i can insert a compare at price so let's say it was originally 180 dollars and now it's 89 dollars below that you also have the options to charge tax and this is a cost per item so cost per item means how much it costs you to manufacture this item. So let's say it costs us $60 to manufacture this item. And then I can click on save on the top right. And now if I view this product on my Shopify store, I'll open this up. You will see it has been displayed as marked down from $180 to $89 instead. Now, in comparison, if you want to do this with a item that has variants, so let's say we have this particular product, so we have different variants of this, or even our initial example, which was of this baby romper, yeah. So for the baby romper, let's say we have two variants, and I'll just click on the variants, and I'll click on bulk edit. And once you click on bulk edit, you should be able to see the variants available. Now, the variants in this haven't been added properly, so I am going to alter the variants available. So first off, we have color, and I'll delete that. And I'm just going to add sizes, so I'll add small, medium, and then large, like this. Small, medium, and then we have large. Once I do that, I have three different variants. Now, to be able to add a different price or add a discounted price for one variant while keeping a original price for my other variants, I have to do some editing. So you can select all of your variants available and click on the top right corner and click on edit prices. So you can apply a specific price to all of your variants. So let's say I want all of my variants other than one variant to be costing $80. And this will be applied to all and let's say for the small size only i can edit the price to 40 or 30 dollars let's say it's 30 dollars and then i can click on save on the top right now i'm going to click on save product on the top right and once i've done that this will display different variant options and different variant quantities for our product now in this particular option we have only done this for one variation. If you're also offering multiple different variants, your variant status is going to be a bit different. So I, for this particular product, only have, you know, sizes. If you are offering other variants like colors on top of sizes, so if I offer color on top of that, let's say it's in yellow and then it's in green like this. So now instead of having three variants, I actually have three into two variants. So that would mean that I have six variants available and I can click on over here. And even within small, let's say for the small size in green, that is $30. And for the small size in yellow, I want it to be $60. And once I do that, I can click on save and this will vary the pricing between all of my variants, no matter what type of variation, either the size or color is applied. So if I view my product from here in my Shopify store, you will see a simple uh, price variation will be displayed. So if I select a particular color, the price will be varied, and this will enable you to add discounts to variants in Shopify stores. 
Now, another way that you can add discounts that can be a bit easier for you to navigate is by adding direct store discounts. So to be able to add bundles or direct store discounts, you can click on discounts on the left panel. Once you do that, you can go on ahead and click on create discount on the top right. So if I click on create discount over here, I have four basic types of discounts. Free shipping is pretty basic, so I'm not going to cover that in this tutorial. Instead, we're going to be focusing on the amount of product, amount of order, and buy X, get Y. Now, for this type of amount of product, you can select a specific collection or a specific product that is going to have a discounted price. However, this discounted code or this discount will be offered directly. So let's say it's flat 30% off on baby items. And then what I will do is I will add a percentage amount. I can add a fixed amount like five to $10 as well, but I'm adding a percentage and I can choose a specific collection or product. So for me, I want to choose specific product. And for us, what I can do is I can select my baby product. Now, even with this discount, if I want to only add this discount to a certain variation. So for example, I only want to offer this discount on the small yellow color so if i want to offer it on this i can click on add and then i'll click on save and the minimum purchase limit is going to be one dollar and then after that we have the combination so if this discount can be combined with other discounts and i'll click on save this is a combinable discount now if i update my section over here in my shopify store i should be able to see a further discounted price so instead of 80 dollars, it has now been marked down to 60 dollars on our shopify store now this is just one type of discount if you want to offer something a bit more tempting for customers you can add a discount on the total amount of their order so let's say this is going to be an automatic discount and i might want to just add this as you know whatever you want to title this you can add that and this can either be a percentage or fixed amount you can also choose the availability if this would be available on your physical brick and mortar store or if this is an online only discount then you have the minimum purchase requirement for a amount off order discount usually people do set a minimum purchase so let's say if someone spends over 50 dollars they get a 5% discount. So if anyone spends over $50 on my store, I offer them a 5% discount. And after that, we have combinations if this discount can be combined with other offerings. And I don't want this to be a combinable discount. And once I do that, I can click on save. And the title is going to be 5% off on minimum spend of 50 USD. And then I'll just click on save over here. And once I do that, this discount will be created. Now, one thing to note is that these discounts are not directly advertised on your store. So you will have to advertise them on your own. So if you want to advertise them, you can create a couple of sections, rich text, as well as announcements in your announcement bar to display these discounts. Now, at last, we have a simple buy X, get Y discount where you can offer a freebie or a second product at a discounted price with the purchase of one product. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe.